Come check out my new merch store on Society6. Find the link in the description down below. Hello everybody and welcome back to Analog Vernacular. Today we're going to be playing some more Soul Hackers 2. This is our second episode. So uh, we've got our long-legged friend here, Ringo, and uh, we need to get out of this place. So um, we're basically heading back the way we came and trying to escape. Um, we've picked up Milady. Or I should say, Milady. My bad. What is this? Portals. Once you've discovered special waypoints known as portals, you'll be able to instantly teleport between portals within the same dungeon. They can make long dungeon treks much more efficient, so keep an eye out for them. Okay. So we can go straight back to the entrance, but um, this looks like it's locked according to the map. Okay, so yeah, this is designed to just take us back. I'm gonna go around this corner and see if an enemy appears though, because I kinda wanna get into a couple more fights. But I think this is probably designed to just have us use that portal. Yeah, I think it is. All right, Ringo. We'll use your portal then. And back to the safe house. A hideout somewhere within the city. Your party can recover here at any time. The covenant that appeared from Milady's corpse was unexpectedly absorbed into Fig. After resurrecting the ca uh, caustic Milady, the group heads to Arrow's hideout? Safe house? Safe house. Ringo is very pleased. Melody? Not so much. <laughs> she didn't look impressed. But uh, hey, Fig and Ringo are kind of new to this whole real life existence thing. Hmm. Not really what I expected, but it's not bad. Glad you like it. Fig. Milady, feel free to make yourselves at home, too. Thank you for everything, Arrow. <laughs> okay, let's get right into it. Arrow, you were trying to save Milady because of that light form thing, right? Guess there's no point in hiding it now, is there? Yeah, that's right. The Covenant came out of Milady and then went into me. <sighs> of course. It's because I died. I get that these Covenant things are important somehow, but I'm only just now starting to wrap my head around it. Can you tell me more about them? You two are Devil Summoners, after all. Hmm. <laughs> Alright. This is my understanding of it. Covenants are like a big source of energy, and they've been passed down from soul to soul for generations. Supposedly, these Covenant holders wield great power. What kind of power? Well, simply put, possessing a covenant awakens the holder's latent abilities. In some cases, it can even spark, well, evolution. They say there's a total of five covenants out there. Having one as powerful as it is, but the effects would only go as far as the individual could take them. Now, if someone were to possess all five, then that'd be something else entirely gather up all five covenants, and you could... You could what? You could call forth what's known as the Great One, a being prophesied to bring ultimate destruction to the world as we know it. That's what they say, at least. Summoning this Great One is Phantom's top priority. Am I right, Melody? Please. You don't really need me to confirm that, do you, Mr. Double Agent? If the Holder dies, the Covenant gets passed on to someone else. As a result, there's almost always some sort of conflict surrounding them. What a surprise. Interesting. So she had the Covenant, which is why they wanted to kill her. So, with that being the case, she may have thought that they were on her side and they double-crossed her. So she may have some real beef with these guys. 
I see now. So when Milady died, the Covenant found a new owner in Fig. These Covenants and this world-ending Great One you mentioned. I believe these may be the seeds that make Ion's prediction come true. Gotta be. Considering we're trying to stop the end of the world, the Phantom Society's shaping up to be a pretty big obstacle. Agreed. And now that we know their intentions, we must protect this Covenant inside of me at all costs. That's going to be a problem for me. <laughs> she wants it back. Our summoning abilities are... changed. We don't have control over our demons. Ringo does. We think it might be due to the soul hack. Excuse me? No one told me about this. Okay, so we've got ourselves a little bit of an uneasy alliance here. Melody's gonna have to toe the line. Don't look at me. There's still Ion Enhanced Summoning. You can still summon through me, however. Do you think you can make do with that? I'd rather you just give me my summoning abilities back along with my Covenant. Can you do that? Mm, not right away, no. You owe me for bringing you back to life. Just think of this as a little collateral for the time being. Ooh, well, it's not a cold. terribly good deal for me, like is it. it? Way I see it, I'm basically your slave. You don't mince words. I like that. Still, I'm afraid I can't back down that easily. What exactly is the Covenant to you, Melody? I don't think I need to explain why the Phantom Society needs summoners, do I? Right. So you're after the end of the world too, huh? <laughs> hey, Ringo. Mind if I ask you something? Sure. What's up? Ion aren't human, right? So why was the Covenant passed on to Fig? What are you? Really? We agents of Ion are highly intelligent beings born from a sea of information. By installing an ego into a simulated human body, the foundation is laid for a soul to develop alongside it. So a machine can have a soul? Is that so strange? Your bodies are practically machines too, albeit fleshy ones. Even for our kind, there is still a lot about the soul that remains unknown. Like where they come from, or what they truly are. We're no experts either. But the self-evident truth is, should one accurately recreate a human body and provide it with a means of control, then a soul will naturally take root. In other words, it's not just this mechanical shell, or rather, this body at play. It's a complex chain of different physiological reactions that shape the soul. <sighs> yeah, I didn't get any of that. Okay. Then we're supercomputers trapped inside grandfather clocks. In even plainer terms, our origins may be different, but we are more or less the same as humans. The trade-off is, in this form we can't operate at Ion's full power, nor do we have access to massive amounts of data like we used to. Ah, oh, I see. I guess that's why they said this form was the most ideal for our mission. Can't really soul hack if you don't have a soul yourself, can you? Oh, that's right, Ringo. I meant to tell you earlier, but I've made a new discovery. It's about Target Alpha, Ichiro Onda. If I remember right, that's the famous computer engineer. What about him? Well, let's revive him too, huh? Fig was acting separately from me at the time. She was trying to protect Onda just as I was trying to protect you, Arrow. The mission was a failure, but I managed to restore the surveillance camera footage. I found a video of what happened in the 24th Ward Municipal Tower. And? He was killed by someone named Iron Mask. Did you say Iron Mask? The leader of Project C finally makes his move. And that's, uh, Milady's bow. It was him. So, Former bow, you know probably. Him. <laughs> or, well, I guess you would, seeing as you two are together. You are? <laughs> he called himself Iron Mask. Are you absolutely certain? Let's take a look at the footage. Outputting video. Impressive. I 
Can't imagine how many security measures were in your way. You're no mere trespasser. Ichiro Onda, I presume. The greatest computer engineer of our time. It's a pleasure. And you are? I am the leader of Project C. You may call me Iron Mask. <laughs> a bit on the nose. Was Black Suit taken? Or are you a prisoner broken free? Well, it's fine. You're welcome to celebrate with me, Masked Man. So is your little wallflower. <sighs> it's complete. A system to shatter the status quo with a perfect name to shake the very foundation of academia. The Omni System. Glorious, isn't it? Can't you feel its power? But now it's finished, and I'm done with it. If you're a thief, then go ahead and take it. You've designed a masterpiece, Doctor. The Omni System will uplift mankind to new heights. Alas, I'm afraid your part in our grand pageant ends here. We want something quite different from you. I should have known. If you don't want my creation, then you must be after me. Well, what dwells within me? You want the Covenant. Ah, you're already aware. You do know I'm a genius. Yeah, that got you real far there, buddy. <laughs> Say, masked man, one last tip. Call it a parting gift from a genius. No one can control the future. Iron Mask. At least I have a future. Goodbye, Ichiro Anna. Your covenant served you well, but it will serve me far better. So melodramatic, these guys. I like it. The melodrama is going to be strong in this game, I can already tell. So that's it. Ichiro Anda was a Covenant holder too. And we got a good look at Iron Mask. Plus, whatever that freaky, murdery guy was. The guy that tore out Anda's Covenant, you mean? Strength like that definitely isn't human. Maybe it's some new species of bear or something? Melody, you were on Iron Mask's team. Know anything about that? Not really. All I know is he called that thing Zenin. He also referred to it as a vessel for the Covenants. A vessel for the Covenants, huh? It seems he lacked the power to fend off their attack. Say, Milady, if you and Iron Mask are an item, why is he after you? <laughs> Ringo, what would you say to working together? You help me meet with Iron Mask. Yeah, she wants What's to know it for too. Me? <laughs> I'll help you prevent this end of the world or whatever you've been going on about. And I'll give you all of the Covenant Holders' names. Deal? You sure? I thought you wanted the world to end. Some things take priority. All right then, Melody. It's a deal. Rather quick to trust, aren't you? Not at all. But we both benefit from this. And for now, that's all I need. 
Speaking of which, I'm hoping we can count you in too, Arrow. Sure. It's not like I don't have stakes in this. All right then. It's settled. Let's all just try to get along from here on out. <sighs> what did I just say? You call that getting along? Arrow, did you do something to her? No. At least, I don't think so. Oh, really? Yatagarasu never did anything to interfere with the Phantom Society's plans? Well, that's nothing new. Phantom and Yatagarasu have been at each other's throats for forever. I hate it when humans act like this. Hey, Melody! Maybe try to look at Arrow as his own person, rather than as a member of Yatagarasu. I suppose I can do that. On to the main topic. Melody, if you could go over the Covenant Holders for us. Right. These are the five people the Phantom Society had marked as Covenant Holders. First is Iron Mask, leader of the Covenant Recovery Project, or Project C. He's a Covenant Holder as well. The Covenant Recovery Project. How is the Phantom Society able to identify these individuals? A Covenant Holder can detect another simply by looking at them. A quick glance in their direction is all it takes. Coupling that with the organization's power, the Phantom Society has been able to identify Covenant Holders for a long time. So we now have somebody on our team who can identify them in FIG. Up next, we have Ichiro Onda, our late computer engineer. He held a Covenant, but had no summoning ability. Going off the security footage we just saw, his Covenant is currently being held by that man, Zenon. This means Iron Mask is in possession of at least two Covenants at this time. The third Covenant Holder is a Devil Summoner, Mangetsu Kuzunoha. I imagine a certain someone here knows a lot more about him than I do, though. So I swear, like, every single game that involves Devil Summoners is gonna have a Kuzunoha, aren't they? He's one of Yatagarasu's top cool. Devil Summoners, and one of the key players in protecting this country. There you have it. The fourth is a man named Saizo, who operates out of Karakacho. He's a freelance summoner who's had dealings with both Yatagarasu and the Phantom Society. And lastly, our fifth Covenant Holder was me. Though that's clearly not the case anymore. That's the one I currently have. So many of them have switched owners in such a short time. It's kind of hard to follow. Hang on a sec. Does that mean Iron Mask was targeting those two Covenant Holders at once? If that's true, then the others could be in danger too. Milady. Any idea where Saizo might be? Word is, he's typically hanging around Bar Hydran about this time. It's over on Jinsando Street. Then that's where we gotta go. You coming, Fig? I'll wait here for everyone. If worse comes to worst, we can't allow our enemies to obtain any more covenants. That said, you'll need an operator of sorts to appraise the situation. So allow me to play that role from the back end. Roger. We'll let you handle things here then. Yeah, that's probably a good idea anyway, because um, we don't necessarily want her out in the field where she's going to be seen by any of these people who would be able to tell that she has the Covenant now. Melody has joined the party. You can now navigate to Shinsando from the city map. Okay. The safe house is the team's base of operations. If you select rest from the menu, the party will fully recover HP and MP. Also, certain downloadable content items can be collected at the safe house. Select DLC from the menu to claim any items you've downloaded. However, keep in mind that attempting to receive any items over your maximum limit will result in the extra items being discarded. Yep, no available DLC. Well, none that we have. Okay, so she comes with on Meraki. Which uh, will have fire skills, if I'm not mistaken. Alright, so you... Let's see. Nice to meet ya. Yep, Augie. And we'll learn Tarukaja. Good stuff. Alright.
No more games. This ought to do it. Okay, so if we're gonna do that, then you should take... Dormar. That's so funny. And I actually want to keep on Meraki on you for a while until... Until we get, uh, his mystique. Sando. Having been murdered on the orders of her former lover, Milady joins Ringo determined to find the answers. She informs them that a summoner named Saizo holds another covenant. Cool, it even tracks in the bottom left who has what covenants. I wonder if that's going to be changing around a lot during this game. Bar Hydrin. Bar up the stairs is Hydrin. Hope this Sizo guy's in today. Shinsando is a trendy commercial hotspot full of Vogue boutiques and classy cafes. You can buy accessories at Zafiro or visit Bar Hydrin, a local nightlife favorite where all kinds of people and rumors can be found. What's up? Oh, you're cute. Uh, oh, fuck you. I hate that. What is it? Have you fallen for me? Huh? Saizo? Who's that? I, I don't get it. The stupid auto sucks in this game. <laughs> Sorry? Who who let that through freaking testing? Saizo? Ever heard of him, hero? Huh? Huh? Who's that? Huh? Saizo never heard of him. Is he famous or something? If you're looking for someone, you might have better luck asking one of the shopkeepers instead of the people passing by. Okay. So if this is where we can get accessories, is up there, then we should go and check that out too. Aww. I wonder what Maki's doing. Huh? You're looking for someone? Sorry, I wouldn't know. Huh? Saizo, of course I know Saizo. The high fashion brand Saizo, right? The designer there. Huh? That's not what you're talking about? Not even close. Zafiro, huh? Looks like an accessories boutique. Oh, a customer? I'm Mannequin. Might as well save you the breath. First timers always beg to know my name, but I can hardly blame them. I mean, look at me. Oh dear. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Well, Cold. browse at your leisure. It's only humans who want the finest glamour money can buy. But don't take it too hard when you realize you'll never reach my level. Yeah, whatever, mannequin. She's already way beyond you. Oh, God, I'm gorgeous. <laughs> this guy can't get enough of himself. Can he even see us? Does he even know he's running a shop? It's almost impressive. What? No, impossible, inconceivable. Whoa, uh, what's up? You okay? I see now. You're not human, are you? Huh. Why do you say that? Well, there certainly can't be a human more beautiful than me in this world. Oh, so now he's trying to put the moves on her. Okay. Oh. Uh, thanks? Yeah, yeah, don't fall for it, Ringo. I won't settle for second best. Let me know if you need help. As a Firo, you can buy accessories for Ringo and the party. Accessories can enhance your defenses drastically, so don't forget to equip them. You can equip purchase accessories in the summoner menu. As you progress in the store, you'll find the store will get new items in stock. So check back now and then. Okay, so there's only one accessory per person then? Is that right? Yeah, okay, so we have an outfit, we have an accessory, we have a mystique, demon, and comp. Okay, strength up, int down, agility up. 
and defense plus four. Okay, so Milady. Milady and Ringo seem to have the highest base strength. At the moment, at least. Ten to thirteen. You want to buy that? Thanks. You want to wear it? All right. You want to buy that? I give you agility. Thanks. You want just to be safe. And let's give you the defense. You want to buy that? Thanks. You want to wear it out? That should work. And there's our money gone. <laughs> it was designed to perfectly allow us to buy one accessory per person. Are you still here? We'll keep a hold of those for now. There's probably not a reason to, but... Are you still here? We will. Beautiful. It seems like he's not paying attention. Better ask someone else. See ya. See ya. What's up? Saizo? Yeah, I know him. We chat here from time to time. Did he come by today? You ought to ask Hughes. He might know. Okay, I'm guessing that's the bartender. Hey, Hughes. Where's Saizo at? Welcome. Ah, there's a new face in town. Name's Hughes. I own the place. Hughes, huh? I'll remember that. What can I get you? Never hurts to start with something easy like a white ale or the like. Sorry, but we're actually looking for someone. His name's Saizo. You haven't seen him, have you? Saizo? He was here not too long ago, but I think he left for work. You might catch him over in Karakacho. That's where he runs his day-to-day. -day. We'll need to hurry. Thanks for the wreck. I'll save it for next time. You can now navigate to Karakucho from the city map. Oh, so we can go directly to Severo or the bar if we want to. Cool. Over here. Wait up, Milady. Karakucho is a haven of indulgence and commercialism. Here you'll find Club Cretaceous, where summoners can find private jobs, and De La Mancha, a superstore chock full of items. Club Cretaceous in particular will be a vital resource, since that's where you can find requests seeking the help of devil summoners. You can earn a number of rewards by completing them, so it's recommended to balance your progression in the story with handling some requests now and then. Okay. Pardon? Saizo? No, I don't know him. Welcome, welcome! Those in search of cheap prices, look no further! De La Mancha is here to please! Hello there. Well, aren't you polite? My name is Yume. If you have any questions, 
feel free to ask me. What do you sell here? Anything and everything. It's what sets our store apart from just about everywhere else. I know it's a little noisy in here, but by all means, take a look around. Welcome to De La Mancha. All right, so let's at least see what we can get here, even though we can't really buy anything right now. So we've got medicine, we already know what that does. Revives one ally with a small amount of HP. Cures poison, paralysis, dread bomb. And restores 40 MP to one ally. Cool. So look at that, you can only hold five of these chakra powders. Interesting, okay. Uh, increase one ally's attack for three turns. Defense, and aim and dodge. Furry guarantees the party's escape from battle. Okay. Is there anything else? You want to sell that? Thanks a bunch. You want to sell that? Thanks a bunch. You want to sell that? Thanks a bunch. Is there anything else? Will this do it for you? Thanks a bunch. Is there anything else? Huh? Mr. Saiza the detective? Oh yeah, I know him. He's a regular here. That reminds me, I feel like I saw someone dressed sort of like him pass by the shop not too long ago. Please come again! Welcome. Welcome to Karakacha. Ka Karakucho. A town built on drink, tears, and love. Saizo, no idea. Look, if you're not a customer, don't waste my time. Okay, hyped man. Huh? What? You want to know more about Johannes? Oh, not him? Saizo? I don't know who that is. Well... Saizo? Uh, sure I know him. That quick-witted detective, right? Where is he? Sorry, I wouldn't know. Okay, let's go to De La... Oh, we can't go to De La Manchi right now. Fair enough. Breaking Mart? And it looks like the Breaking Bad thing symbols. Oh god. They're just ripping off Breaking Bad now. How could they? Good evening. It's a good show. I'm watching uh, Better Call Saul now. You're not the first person I've seen rushing around wild eyed tonight. What's the deal? Some local restaurant got an all you can eat deal that's about to expire? Huh? Saizo. Don't know about a Saizo, but we do have a Taizo over at our club. Not qu quite what I'm looking for. Oh, is this the place where we get the side quests? This might be the place. So this is what they call a club. Look at this! Look, there's freaking Tamlin over there. Um, What's that Gumby-looking motherfucker? And, uh, Mc... Uh, something. Man, I cannot remember all their names. Well, from the looks of you, I take it you live on our side of the world. Huh? Sorry for surprising you, stranger. The pleasure's all mine. I'm Ginkgo, Madam Ginkgo, to some of our summoner regulars. Nice to meet you, Madam Ginkgo. I'm Ringo, but I'm not exactly a summoner. What do you mean, your side of the world? Here at Club Cretaceous, we provide certain specialty services to the people of the city. More specifically, we put clients in contact with summoners for private contracts. Really now? Sounds like this place is good for more than the nightlife. Oh yeah, the Gumby guy is Makoi. So if I drop by, I can hear about some local problems that need a summoner's skills? That's what you're saying? Yes, that's correct. Okay. Why tell me about this? Sounds like you want me in on these jobs. Got something you want me to do? I'm sure I will soon enough. Saving the world is certainly a noble cause, but there are times when you must narrow your scope and hear the smaller voices. All I'd ask is that you help the people who need it. That's the true calling of a devil summoner, after all. Sounds fun. Might help me get the information I need, too. Welcome. Clients in need of summoner's help will send requests to Club Cretaceous. The domain of Madame Ginko. Here, you may accept requests and hear Madame Ginko's briefings before setting off. Clients will have icons above them indicating the current status of their request. Keep track of these to get a quick sense of your next move. A new request was added. Allow me to explain. 
Perhaps you've seen the store de la Mancha on this street. Our client for this request works there, a girl called Yume. Even I've shopped there on occasion. We've talked enough that I know something of her troubles. To tell the truth. A short while ago, she lost something of great importance to her. It's left her in clear distress. I did some inquiring myself, and after some investigation, I can say with confidence that a demon is responsible for this. I ask that you handle this as well. Consider this request placed on my behalf as well as on hers. I'd be grateful if you could help. Okay, client is Yume. Location, Karakucho. Ideal level is six. Reward, new items at De La Mancha. Will you accept? I will. I humbly ask this of you. My thanks. I suggest you head to De La Mancha and get the details directly from her. Lady on the As mind? As to this request. The client for that request works at a host club in Karakucho. Typically, civilians don't get to have any involvement in our business, but it does happen every now and then. It would seem this client is caught up in a rather peculiar fate, and is therefore unsure of how to proceed. Your task this time around is simply to find someone. Very basic, yes, but it's an ideal warm-up nonetheless. Okay, Teria, Karakucha, ideal level 5, 3,000 yen. I humbly ask Best this. of luck, your client should be waiting for you in Karakucho. Okay. Do you have any other business with Oh. You're looking for Saizo? No, I've not seen him today. Though, thinking back, I did sense a powerful aura of spiritual power nearby. It's possible he could be involved somehow. I bid you good luck. Okay. Are you serious? Hey, you the one Madam Geeko sent? I'm your client, Teria. Wow, so the rumors were true. What luck. So, uh, yeah, I'm looking for a girl. She came to our club about a month ago. <laughs> she was so beautiful, I'm telling you, it was love at first sight. We're talking the real deal here. <sighs> but she hasn't come by since. If I don't get this love letter to her, then it's nothing more than a scrap of paper. Please! You've got to find her and give her this letter for me. Terry is love letter. Any details? Uh, let me think. Well, I know her name's Chris, and I've heard she works near the shipping district. At least I think she does. Oh. I'm actually not all too sure what her job is. Salmon runner or some earner or something like that. <laughs> so good listener too, apparently. Can I help you, miss? Huh? Uh, Miss Ginko sent you? Oh, geez, she didn't have to do all that just for me. Still, I'd be glad to help. Can't make an omelet without breaking some eggs, I guess. Actually... Truth is, I lost some Frost Diver superhero merch near the shipping district. Huh? Whoa, you don't even know what Frost Diver is? No way. It's this awesome live-action superhero show. It's huge. Airs every Saturday morning. Is it? Does it feature Jack Frost? It does, doesn't it? See, he's the ancient warrior frozen in ice. Uh, 20,000 years ago? Except global warming thought him out. And now he's a hero of justice, secretly protecting Earth. He's Frost Diver, the glacial guardian. Okay, maybe he's not related to, uh, to, uh, Jack Frost. <laughs> uh, I mean, just so we're clear, it's my little brother who's into it, not me. Uh-huh, sure, yeah. Whatever you say, Yume. Um... Anyway, so I... Uh, what well, my brother, I mean. My bad. He was playing around with the superhero merch, pretending to be Frost Diver. Definitely not me, though. I would never do that. But one second it was there, and the next it was gone. I think someone might have stolen it. There's nothing left for us! <laughs> but it doesn't make sense. The East Shipping District is off limits, and nobody else was around. I don't get it. Ugh. Still, I shouldn't be unloading all of this on a customer. It's not like it'll change anything. I'd love to see you again! Okay, so before we actually continue this, I'm wondering if I should go to the shopping district. Or the shipping district, I mean, not shopping. Because we got two quests here now. Yeah, let's just uh, check these out, huh? The area is not too large, so it shouldn't take long for us to figure this out. Come on out! You there, Summoner. I'm Frost Ichiro, the eldest of the Jack Frost brothers, Ho. Wouldn't you know, Ho it? I got some D He Muns. I need you to take care of, Ho. Pretty please? You wouldn't abandon a snowman in need, would you, Ho? Okay. So let's see. Frost Ichiro, Lourdes Water. Okay. You really. Uh, you really me he. Eat it? Thanks a lot, Ho. God damn it. 
My brothers and I are looking for a new he-home, somewhere we can live in peace, ho. I'm thinking that see-he-side warehouse ought to do it nice and quiet, ho. he Well, there's just one problem, my little bro. Frost Jiro, he's allergic to spiders. He can't e he even get close to them, ho. And with all the Suchigumo nearby, little bro could never live here. No way. Please, Summoner, help us get rid of those pesky Suchi, uh, Suchi Gumos. Ho, oh, this place will probably he be a lot safer if you defeat five or so, ho. It's all you, I'm Counting ho. on you, Summoner, ho. How dare you call me a ho. Some requests require you to defeat demons roaming dungeons. These enemies will be marked with the icon shown above. This will make it easier to track down and eliminate your targets. Hey, I appreciate that, game. I really do. It's very kind. Alright, we got three party members now, so... Begin. Yeah. Huh. Too slow. What's the plan here? You like that? So you roam away, okay. ability. Very good. Smart choice. Okay. Go, Arrow. Now, Arrow. Right away, Brindle. Ouch. Out of my way. Can I help you? Yeah, I'm Chris. Are you a summoner too? Host club? Yeah, I went once. I got invited by a friend. It was more or less just a bunch of pointless chit chat, though. Thought it was kind of boring. Yeah, she's pretty attractive. He wasn't wrong. She's pretty good looking. Huh? Teria? A love letter? Oh, you mean that loudmouth kid? Hey! Ah, uh, wait. You really came all this way just to deliver this? I see. Uh, well, sorry to waste your time, but I can't accept it. Mind passing on a little message for me instead? My apologies. Tell him he's playing with fire. Get involved and he'll only get burned. Okay. Okay. Seriously, everybody's got the longest of legs, man. I dig it. Commence the assist so, with me. all you. All you, Melody. On it, Ringo. You're wide open. Impressive. Man. Okay. Good idea. Go, Arrow. Now, Got Arrow. It, Ringo. Ah! All equipped. Let's roll. Ah! Out of my way. So nervous. Almost fell asleep. Okay, let's see how we do against just auto attacks right now. When an auto attack is activated, combat will fast forward with Ringo and her allies only using standard attacks. This can help with speeding through more trivial battles. You can turn off auto attack with circle. I'm guessing that these pairings probably aren't too tough. That's a hit. That's just sad. Yeah. Here goes. Uh, here goes nothing. How are you still up? Damn. And they just had to get okay. in the way. Specific elimination targets in some requests speaking to specific people or demons will launch you into battle. 
Such individuals will be marked with this icon. Make sure you're ready for a fight before you confront them. So this might be the one who stole the uh, item. The demon's holding something. It looks like the superhero merch that you may lost. Huh? Who are you? You got a problem with me? Look, I'm in a bad mood right now, like really super bad. I tried to copy that lady, I did the poses, I yelled the transformation words, said it was morphin' time, but nothing fucking happened. I looked the same. What should you do? Take back the merch. What? The lady friend of yours? That does, I'm gonna kick your butt. You... You know the drill. Let's finish Don't this. be a hero. All right. Feeling Fire is probably not going to work. Ice will almost certainly be a weakness. You know the drill. Let's go with that. Don't be a hero. Is that really your plan? Get you where you stand. My guy don't overlook that. Just what? I All right. And Let's we can at least try Zon. Huh? Out of my way. What? Ooh, both of us are weak to fire right now. You know the That's drill. Rough. Got it. Don't be a hero. We gotta win this. Got it. No matter what. Dance. You know what to do. Let me see. Ooh, that'll work. Go, Arrow. I'll do it, Melody. We gotta win this. On. No matter what. Too late for regrets now. I know we can win Still this. Still with me? Arrow, you okay? Let's promise him. Let him have it, On Arrow. your orders. Ringo, how's Careful the wound? now. Here goes. Boom! Out of my way. About what I figured. Okay. You got the superhero merch. You should return this to Yume. Top off right there, and let's go ahead and give ourselves a uh, hard save real quick. Okay, so technically we found those two quests, so... Uh, what was the Jack... The Jack Frost wanted us to get Suchigumos, that's right. Okay, let's go ahead and do that too then. Thanks. Bye -bye. Can I actually come back to you? No. Okay, so once we use you, you disappear. Yeah. They won't okay. know what hit him. Let's stay cautious. Dance! Okay. I'll get serious. Here goes. What's our let's go? Ooh, that'll work. Let him have On it. On your orders. We can win this. They just had to get in the way. We need something like six of them to go down.
I'll leave this Got to it. you. Ooh, that'll work. Best to go with that. Don't give me orders. Did that hurt? I better step my Okay. Good idea. Don't miss now. You got it. On your orders. Okay. <laughs> Too late for the guts now. So nerve. Wow. Over already? You want me to join you guys? I don't know, it sounds like a lot of drama. Ugh. You've got one of my besties with you. Yes, and I think she's got it covered. Cool, okay. So if you already have them, then uh, you just get an extra heal. Yeah. We want Suchigumos right now. So that's what we're gonna hope for. Yeah. Commence. Let's finish that this. The trick. Blow them away, Melody. All you, Melody. You don't have to tell me. You're wide open. Hey, abuse the weaknesses. Then All right. That should do the trick. This ought to do it. Now, Ringo, works for me. To the map. With this That'll power. work. Go, Arrow. Appreciate the advice. Too late for the guts now. Easy win. 128. That's some big damage at this point in the game. There we go. I'm ready whenever you need you like me. like that? Dance! <laughs> Time to kick uh. off. <laughs> Boom! Now, right. looks promising. Now, Arrow! Got it, Ringo. Worked! Out of my way. Ooh, we got poisoned. Rude. Goes away after a number of turns, but it can be treated more quickly. You're in trouble, Ringo. Yeah. Get lost. Almost fell asleep. So I think we've gotten four, so we need what? Two more? Whenever you need me, Ooh, go for it, Melody. Best to go with that. Got it. Very good. All according. Careful now. Accessing data. Stress. So nervous. Let's go. That'll work. We can part. Reach you where you stand. Nailed it. Out of my way. Wow. Over already. All right, we learned Taru. Next up is Dodge Force. You defeated the Tsuchigumo as requested. You should report back to uh, Frost Ichiro. And just in time too, because we can just take this back. I'm sure that that was not an accident. You defeated five Tsuchigumo already. For some reason, I thought we needed to get six. Amazing, ho. Thank you, ho. Okay, a new he home part one. Now even my little he bro has a place to call home. He's gonna love it, ho. Once again, don't fucking call Ringo a ho. You're upsetting me. Jack Frost's man. Unbelievable. Straight to De La Mancha. Kinda nice that they allow you to just load straight into the store. Welcome 
to De La Mancha. Oh. Um, miss, is that what I think it is? You handed over the superhero merch. That's amazing! Wow, you... Wow, I can't believe you actually found it. Are you a goddess? Really, I can't thank you enough. I was running out of excuses to keep my brother away from it, too. Actually... I've actually got five younger brothers. I first started working part-time here to help out with the family finances. So we don't get a lot of time to spend together as a family, except, well, when Frost Diver comes on. I saved up a ton to get the superhero merch, so it would have really broken my heart to tell them it got stolen. Thanks so much! Thanks for helping me, miss. You've saved the day for our whole family. Okay, new items are in stock at De La Mancha. I'll make it work! What is new? Portable first aid kit and chakra syrup. Cool, okay. Limited. Is there anything else? Thank you! Okay, I got some bad news for you, my man. Oh, you are not gonna like this, I'm so sorry. Huh? Huh? She didn't read my letter? Give up, but why? <laughs> wow, she's too cool, man. Seriously, what a woman. I guess I'm not good enough for her as I am, but I won't let it get me down someday. I'll become a number one host and win her over. Ooh, do I feel a ongoing story starting? <laughs> Wait for me, Chris. All right, here's your reward. Thanks, man. Lady on the Mind is now done. New summoner in town. Complete three or more requests. Cool, okay. Well, um, we're gonna be uh, hitting wherever that little exploration thing is right there to the left where the magnifying glass is in the next episode so thank you all for being here don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see you all in the next episode have a good one everybody i'd like to give a very special shout out to my patron supporters darren york ztd seventh son len knife namase kyle the monarch Andrew Smith, and Jordan and Emily Hill. If you would also like to join this tier or any others, check out my memberships or my Patreon in the description down below.